What's good? It's Chigozi. It's Wednesday, December 19th, 2018. We're going to just glimpse through some of this propaganda. Here we have some Yemeni propaganda. Yemeni mother arrives in the U.S. to see her dying son. So we have this Yemeni actor right here. These Yemeni actors. This is a play. We're going to see some death, killing, murder, coding in this, I'm pretty sure, right in the update time, the video length, because it's about dying. 11.32, 2 plus 3 is 5, you don't reduce 11 because it's a master number, so that's 1.15. One, one, killing equals 1.15. Also 32, like Scottish, like Jerusalem. Here a <laughs> see what I'm saying? I said we're gonna get the numbers for death, killing, sacrifice in the update time and or video length. Look at how many seconds this is. <laughs> one hundred twenty one seconds. <laughs> Blood sacrifice equals one two one, just using the alphabetical order. B is the second letter, L is the twelve, and so on. You add them all one two one. As I called out, we'll get one of those, their favorite numbers in this propaganda. Saturn 201. Also, this is, you know, 201, 102, the police 102, radical Islam, 102, Islamic terrorism, 201, 102. They're putting that number in this propaganda. You know, 102 minutes that changed America or whatever. It's that number. Ye Yemen. This is Yemeni propaganda. Yemeni. These numbers. 91. Come on, the 19th. Oops, well now it just turned December 20th. <laughs> Literally, it's midnight right now, so... I gotta type in... Forty-nine, thirty-one. By the way, Facebook and Washington were in the propaganda. Washington, D.C. sued Facebook over the Cambridge Analytica CA, third letter, first letter. Facebook equals 31, Washington 49. That's where they're in that propaganda that day. 353 is the 71st prime. Yeah, many equals 71. See this? On the 353rd day of the year, we get Yemeni propaganda, 71. See? Always this type of coded nonsense from the Freemasons. Donald Trump is the Yemeni actor. Like the government of Yemen, he is an actor for them. If you are a United States citizen, your government is the same exact government that Ye Yemen has. Look, see this Donald Trump propaganda? Updated at 848. <laughs> Donald Trump equals 48. Masonry 84, Zionism 84. He is an asset of Masonry and Zionism. A piece of shit actor. Sacrifice 55, God 55, Satan 55. Someone breaking silence on alleged harassment instead of CBS legal drama. I know uh, Suits is a legal drama, I think. I'm pretty sure, and that's what Meghan Markle starred in. I'm just, I'm just throwing that out there, you know. You know how they like to link everything around. Eliza Dushku breaks silence on alleged harassment on set of Bull. Updated at 1056. When you run out 33, you get 156. False flag equals 156 in Jewish cipher. Bull has these numbers 47, 61, 25, 11. Time numbers, pi numbers. But there's no deeper riddle to this. Prophecy 106. It's also 66 seconds. Revelation is 66 book. If you run out 33, you get 156 and 66. So they get the two numbers for writing out 33 right here in this propaganda. This is Freemasonic propaganda. One fifty six, sixty six. Two 
propaganda from the Freemasons. 128, Brotherhood 128. 848 again, Donald Trump 48. Um, Macaulay Culkin revisits Home Alone. Let's see, Home Alone's Demetria. 88, 43. Donald Trump, or Trump 88. Masonic Ritual 88. Masonic 43. We're going to have to see how many days from his birthday he did that. Home Alone equals 47. Because H the 19th letter when you reduce. So reduce it once is 10. Home Alone 47. Macaulay Culkin, you all know who he is. He's just another actor for the federal government. Another, no different than Donald Trump. August 26, 1980. So from August 26 till the 19th. August 26 to 19th. 115 days, Masonic 115. There we go. See why I was looking, see why I did this? You see why I did this? So we'll start from the beginning. We're looking at this Zionist Jew, Jesuit order, Freemasonic propaganda. We see this headline. Coming on the 19th, five hours ago, that's still the 19th. If you're in California now, you're still the 19th. Anyway, Macaulay Culkin revisits Home Alone. See, so I said, okay, this is Home Alone propaganda. So let's do the gematria. Home Alone equals 38. I said, okay, although there's no none of those numbers in the date numerology directly, Let's see how many days from his birthday is he participating in this propaganda because that's where they're going to do the ritual. Home Alone reversing reducing 38 from his birthday to today or the 19th. 16 weeks, 3 days. 163 is the 38th prime number. Do you see how Macaulay Culkin is nothing else than a theatrical actor for these Zionist Jews who practice this Kabbalah? who run Home Alones, whoever produced it. Doesn't matter the company, it's all run by the same gang. It might as well be Paramount Pictures, it doesn't matter. So I hope that's a very clear example. Five-time Olympic gold medalist, retires at 23, 2 plus 3 is 5. 23 is the ninth prime. When you write out 9, when you write out 5, you get 42. Probably something more of that too. Oh, NASA propaganda. Let me look at this. It's about Saturn because it's Saturnalia right now. Started December seventeenth. We're in, so we're in Saturnalia, or at least around Saturnalia. And here they talk, giving you Saturnian propaganda at nine fifty nine. Freemasonry fifty nine. God, Satan, 55. They love to use the number 55 with Saturn. I've documented this sometimes. Saturn doesn't sum the 55, but the number they like to use on their Saturnian propaganda. They worship Saturn, keeper of time. It is one of their gods. Another, you know, 48, just like a propaganda equals 48, 93. They compare 48 with 93, Saturn, 93. Saturn 42, <laughs> on a date with a life lesson number 42, they're publishing this propaganda. Saturn 42, re reversing and reducing, Saturn's beauty is fleeting. I mean, this, I'm about to make another video on this. I mean, a Saturnian piece of propaganda from the federal government deserves its own video. I mean, all I do on this channel is talk about how the federal government, this one world order, worships Saturn, the keeper of time. And literally on during Saturnalia, literally we're, we're, like this is Saturnalia, and they're giving you this propaganda.
December 17th through the 23rd. So we're literally in the middle of Saturnalia. See? <laughs> is, this, that's not was, is an ancient Roman festival in honor of the god Saturn held on December 17th of the Julian calendar and later expanded with festivities through to December 23rd. The holiday was celebrated with a sacrifice at the Temple of Saturn. You know, they had ritual sacrifices that day in the Roman Forum and blah, blah, blah. You can read it here. A carnival atmosphere. Guys, every single day, this is a carnival atmosphere. And you, if you're completely new here, I know you're agreeing with me. Just watching what's going on in the White House alone, it's a carnival atmosphere. Because Donald Trump is a carnival actor. He is a Saturnian actor playing the role of Saturn, the keeper of time. I cannot emphasize it enough. It's also why you know, I was propaganda during the time of Saturnalia. But I can't believe this. They gave us literally an opinion on Saturn, on Saturn during Saturnalia, on a date with a lifeless number 42, Saturn 42. Saturn 69. There was 69 numerology as well. The keeper of time. Time equals 20. 353 is the 71st prime. 71 is the 20th prime. I kind of want to write out December 19th and see what that sums to. 88. 89. 317 to 66 prime. 88, re 88 represents time as well. 88, that's four circles, 1400, 40 degrees. Back to the future, they go four or 88 miles per hour. Don Lincoln, you know, Don equals 33. Don. <laughs> Don Lincoln. 49, you know, this propaganda did with 49 numerology. 158, like Freemasonry, Scottish 4950, Mathematics 112, Circle 112, you see what I'm saying? Mathematics 112, Circle 112, Zionist 112, it's like a mathematical number. 1 plus 1 is 2, and we're talking about Saturn, the keeper of time, and cycles, and circles, and all that. And here we get some guy named with 112 named Demetria in this piece of Saturnian propaganda. It's just, it's just unbelievable. This is why I love clicking on NASA's propaganda. Look at all their artwork here. People look up to these people. People want to spend more billions of dollars. Guys, billion, billions of dollars go to this theatrical stage performance production company. That's all it is. A theater production company for your entertainment, for your deception. NASA, guys, I don't, it's funny, I never even looked to see if it's actually NASA propaganda before calling it NASA propaganda. Notice I never have to. Anything from space is propaganda from NASA. And I can say that freely because, guys, this, Donald Trump, is propaganda from NASA. All of this is propaganda from NASA. NASA are the Freemasons. They are the Zionist Jews. They are the Jesuit order. Basketball is their bullshit as well. Now I like how they pair this 239 next to Donald Trump here. A little flag riddle there. So that's what I'm saying. And look, Elon Musk, talking about Elon Musk too on that day. Elon Musk always in Saturnian propaganda. So see, Facebook said another piece of propaganda on that day. Facebook equals 31, a date with 31 numerology, they're in propaganda. You know, two pieces. They're in this, and they're in the, and the one bug of them getting sued. Oh, wow, look. Look what they updated at. 431. Do you see what I'm trying to teach here? This is why I like teaching this stuff. It's easy to teach, because I'm, I'm telling you before we saw this. Remember early in the video, I said... Washington, Facebook, Washington 49, Facebook 31, Washington DC suing Facebook. I explained how 31 is an important number for Facebook. They participate in propaganda by that number. And there, this 
Probably in about Facebook. Updated at 431. With a Wells Fargo ad. I kind of wonder. Or it says Wells Fargo up there. You know, death numbers. 118. Sacrifice 46. Two number for division. 120 seconds. Illuminati 120. Work to do, that's coded. You know, you can decode all these things in quotes. I'm about to close this video, though. To hold Facebook accountable, stop calling it a tech company. Well, yeah, it's not a tech company. It's a propaganda enterprise. It's a mind control device. So I guess you can call it, it is a piece of, it is a piece of technology used to control the minds of the masses. So, I mean, you can call it a tech. You can, I guess you can call it a tech company. That's what it is. It's a shell company, some shell organization, some false flag, Zionist Jew theater troupe. Participating in false flag, fake news propaganda, and it's a software application used to distract, deceive the boyum, and propagate propaganda, waste their time. Bang. Why do they have Bang here in these work in the front page? Price Freemasonic branding. <laughs> Masonry eighty four. Zionism eighty four. Freemason forty two to reflection twenty four. Forty seven is the fifteenth prime number. Saturn twenty one. You know, Masonry, Zionism, Jesuit, all eighty four. And why does Masonry, Zionism, and Jesuit all equal eighty four? And all I do is talk to you about I will see Freemasons, the Jewish bankers, Zionists, the false Jews from Revelation, and the Jesuit order. Papa Militiatis. You know, Militiatis, military. If this has some killing type of pattern, I'm just going to flip. Oh, nope. It, it has even what I, well, it does, but sacrifice 67, 86, so it does exactly what I have, what I was saying. But, in my mind, I even wanted to look at this. I didn't say it out loud, but I was like, this probably sums to 58. I mean, all these fucking names, some usually sum to 58, like Freemasonry, Freemasonry 58, 67, Federal Government 85, 86, again, Blood Sacrifice 67, 86, Papa Militiatis, you know, the Papa of the Military. I know this is, guys, Facebook is from the military. I mean, I, I hope this piece of propaganda explains that a little bit more to you. Architect 87. I get Facebook 3158. 158, 41. They share data because they've been sharing data since the inception, since before Facebook even came out. I guess I don't get the problem. Anytime Facebook does something with <laughs> everyone's information, I never care. They already have all my information. They've had my information since birth. It doesn't matter. I don't, want, I don't want people to freak about the whole privacy shit. Guys, they have all your shit. It, it doesn't matter. It's the federal government. They know where you live. They know what you do. You know, 44, kill 44, time 144, you run out of 44, you get 144. Probably some more Egyptian connection with that. When your child wants the truth about Santa, you know, propaganda. Santa's just, look at this, look at this shit. Lucifer equals 323. Santa and Satan are anagrams. And here they give you the Jewish value for Lucifer inside this satanic piece of propaganda. Wow. That's what I'm saying when they always do these things. <laughs> Look, Santa in the Jewish cipher is... 232, two, they're shuffling a 323. Three. Because again, Santa is Satan. It's all the same, the Matrix, same fucking name. And Lucifer, 323. Three. And again, why does Lucifer and Satan have that type of, you know, pattern going on? So you see what just happened here. And then we go to the propaganda. 
I'm talking about Santa during this Saturnalia. What the fuck? Get that actor out of here. What the fuck are these people with the stupid modals giving me more propaganda I don't want? Updated 323. Lucifer 323. Because they will spam your inbox with the propaganda. I know once I said it's a good way to get the... I mean, still, if you, it's up to you. If you want them to email you propaganda to decode, you have to look for it. It's like them emailing you different homework exercises. You know what I mean? It, <laughs> literally, if you ever want more homework, just it, fill in some email. You know, make some, you can make a new email just solely for practice, for homework. And then every, every time there's a modal pop-up that says, hey, give us your email so we can... Keep following up with you. Keep programming you through our email list. You can use all their emails, find the articles they're linking in there, and decode them. See how they're all coded. See this pattern. It's a good, it's a good way to be served homework instead of having to find all the propaganda yourself. But <laughs> again, it's not even hard to do. Look at all we found already. We're like just 20 minutes in. I'm about to close this right now. Cause I should. I mean, guys, I can sit. I can sit for the next five hours talking about all this propaganda. Emily Blunt didn't do this for Mary Poppins. I'm not even gonna look at that. I'm sure it's super coded. It's, it's probably an extremely good example. I'm skipping over, but Korean air nut rage. I'm just calling these out. If you can, you know, decode them yourself if you want. Yeah, Facebook gave some firms the ability to read users' messages. Guys, they've been always been able to read all of your messages. I don't get why the, I hate. I really hate how this stuff is news. It's such a mocking. Like how Edward Snowden came out and said that the government is watching you and shit. I'm like, well, of course they've been doing this. And people start freaking out. Like, why are you guys freaking out? They've been doing this shit forever. Just because they sent some actor out to tell you doesn't mean that now they're doing it. Uh, that's like the that's one of their propaganda tactics that just irritates me the most. It's like it's just wasting this news space to talk about shit that's literally already been happening, which is pretty much all of it. All of it anyway. Anything that's actually ever ever truthful or real from this propaganda has already been going on well in advance. Literally, go to their health section. It's either crap, fake news, bullshit propaganda, or anything. You're like, yeah, I know it's real. It's, I've known this several years ago. Maybe I'll save it for another day. No Freemasonry 139. Fear over stupid woman accusation. No, she's not a stupid woman. She's just an actor for the federal government. She's probably super high IQ. I don't know. I don't care. I, don't, I hate her. She's retarded. So are all her followers. If you voted for Theresa May, you voted for a tyrant, an actor. For the Freemasons, you know, 31 amazing sports photos. They were 31 numerology. This is up here. This week in 23 photos, Donald 23. George H.W. Bush, his life in pictures. Let's just see how many pictures are here. Let's see what is updated. You know, updated 119, Saturn 119 on 11 slash 9, 1990. He gave a speech. 11 years to the day of 9 11, 11 9, 2001. He gave his New World Order speech then about the conspiracy. Well, it's about, it's about to protect terror, but you know, the New World Order is supposedly some big conspiracy, which it is. I mean, it is. I mean, it absolutely is. It's just, it's so fucking blatant and obvious. Sometimes it's hard for me to fathom that it's still some conspiracy. Like, you know, it's right, it's such right in your face. It doesn't even deserve to be called that. And of course, guys, these are Zionist Jews, Freemasons, Jesuits, they're a brotherhood, they're a Masonic brotherhood. So them working together, is that really conspiring? By definition it is, but again, is it in secret? I'm just, like, what else do you expect them to do? That's what I'm like, what's what I mean? What else do you expect them to do? I expect them to do nothing else. If the Talmud says it's okay for them to lie to Gentiles, if all they do is put on this 113 dishonest bullshit, Scottish Ray Freemasonic crap every single day, and it's okay, and, and we're just goy slaves, we don't mean anything, we're just cattle, we're meant to be deceived and led down the path of the agenda. If that's the whole point, then what's the secret? What's the conspiracy? 
just, they're just behaving like they're supposed to, a bunch of psychopaths. But anyway, you know, conspiracy one, two, three, December third, Saturn one, one, nine. We already, we already saw this in my video, you know, George or Bush 58, 58 combat missions. But I hope that rant kind of explained to you what's going on. It's how, how I see this stuff. It's the truth. I, I mean, I look at it subjectively. It's just a bunch of bullshit ass Freemasons, Zionist Jew bankers, the Jesuit Order, other Interrelated secret societies in high places crafting this propaganda by the numbers. You know, this is mocking, you know, reverse cognitive decline. Nothing's going to reverse the cognitive decline in America. These people are so fucking retarded. I'm so sick of them. Peace out.